friends, it's Anya and welcome back to my channel. Today is a special video because unlike the previous video, I actually had two people requested this video. Yeah, this is a big thing for me. So for today's video, I will be doing my purple eyeshadow look that I did in one of my previous videos and I asked you guys if you wanted to see it and two people said yes and I am super excited because I will do it. If you want to see how I created this look, then keep on watching. But before we go into the video, if you guys new here, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and ring that bell to get notified every single time I upload. And my giveaway is coming to an end soon. You have two more days to enter. So go and check that video out after you're done watching this one. Now without any further ado, let's just jump into the video. First things first, let's move this hair away from my face. That's better. For this eye look, I used only one palette and that is Mini Breaker from Jawbreaker Collection from Jeffree Star Cosmetics. And I remember when I finished my look, I was super happy that actually this mini palette could make an exciting look and I didn't have to dip into any other palette but this one so that's one of the reasons I really suggest this palette but if you don't like purple colors then this is not for you because it's mainly purple and I tried I really tried and I was going through my closet and I wanted to wear something purple today but this is the closest I got to purple I don't know why and I like purple color but I truly don't have anything my closet that it's purple so it's just gonna be black okay so now let's start with application honestly guys I really hope I still remember what I did with my eyes and if it's gonna look a little bit different I'm so sorry so we're gonna try to recreate it hopefully it's gonna be successful let's see so first eyeshadow I'm gonna go into is double scoop with my fluffy brush and again with your open eyes, if you have hooded eyes, and even if you don't have hooded eyes, you can still do the same thing. I just created a little bit of shadow there, or crease. And because I have hooded eyes, I really tried to go as high as I can, almost into my eyebrows. I don't know if I still remember it though. I think I went into hot fudge next, and I went again with the fluffy, big blending blow blush brush and I focus more on the outside edge like this I know it looks weird but don't worry about it and then I go inwards then you're gonna go back with the same brush you used before with no product on it I mean I didn't pick any extra product there is some product left on but I, I'm not picking anything extra and I'm just going over hot fudge shade I'm gonna do the same thing on the other eye and I'll be right back. Now that hot fudge is on, we're gonna go into shade Bite Me, which is beautiful purple shimmery shade. Now I can't remember did I use, yes, I used setting spray. Just a second. And you're gonna go in the middle of your eyelid and going upwards, try to meet where a hot fudge ends. If you feel like you need more, go ahead and do so. Don't worry about blending yet because we're still not done, not even close. So now we're gonna take this kind of brush and you're gonna dip it into oral and spray it again. And now it's time for our inner corner and drag it toward the bite me color and don't worry to go more inwards because we're gonna take that down too I'm going back into shade bite me 
over it again just to deepen it up a little bit. Now that we have that, we're gonna go back with the same brush that we used before for hot fudge and go back over the hot fudge color just to blend it out better with this purple shimmery colors. And guys, don't be afraid to get close to your eyebrow. Now, I'm feeling like adding a little bit of highlighter. So I'll go back into my Brain Freeze Trusted Highlight Palette and take Gold Breaker. I shouldn't be probably doing this right now, but that's okay. A little bit on the nose. When I said a little bit, I forgot to say a lot. Now take smaller brush, dip into the same highlighter that you are using and highlight your brow bone. After you apply highlighter on your brow bone, go back with the same brush that you used for hot fudge color and don't put any extra product, just blend it out. So that transition between highlight and hot fudge is seamless. Now take a small brush and dip into hot fudge and go very, very close to your lash line. Lower lash line. Now you're gonna take pencil brush and go into first shade that we use and that's double scoop and just blend out a little bit your hot fudge underneath your eyes. You see, that brightened up the look a little bit more than this. What I did last time, I believe, is I went again with the first brush I used for the same double scoop color and I just went a little bit on the edge to bring this look a little bit more together. Just go in between your highlighter and hot fudge. Now, I know I can't go in between in such a small space with such a big brush, but I don't even need to see where exactly I went in with the brush. I just want that orangey or yellow shade to shine through to connect top and bottom, if that makes any sense. And then smudge it on the outer edge too. And now I'm gonna apply eyeliner and fake eyelashes and I'll be right back. 20 minutes later. Mascara is on, fake eyelashes are on and I put also Morphe Coconut White Pencil in my waterline just to make my eyes pop a little bit more. And now it's time to do lips. So I went with this NYX lip liner in shade Pale Pink. I just outline it or overline it. remember but I think I used this lip gloss on top of it or did I use this one you know what let me try first this one and see oh I didn't use this one now since it wasn't that lip gloss I'm gonna use this one this is such a yeah it was this one I love it Starberry Mist and that is it for today's video guys I wind please thank you that is it for today's video guys I really hope you enjoy watching it if you did please give it a big thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my channel and ring that bell to get notified every single time I upload and that's Tuesday Thursday and Sunday and if you're not entered to my giveaway yet go and check this video out you have two more days so good luck have an amazing rest of the day and see you in the next one bye Woo. this is the reason why I don't use gloss